senior members who are playing in their final regular season home game this afternoon. These three individuals have lifted the lacrosse program to new heights, including winning the 2021 Little East Conference regular season championship. Our first senior to be honored today is number three, Jack Riley. Hey, Riley! Three of the lacrosse program, Jack will be appearing in his 21st career game this afternoon. A versatile and athletic player, Jack has registered 17 goals and 11 assists for Beacons Across, while also serving as a key member of the Beacons Ice Hockey Program. A breakout player, Jack has been a member of, the, of two of the most successful teams in recent memory. During his time on the Harbor campus, Jack has led the Beacons to a combined 15 win while also helping them to three straight LEC tournament appearances. Hailing from Rentham, number three, Jack Riley. Our second senior to be honored today is number 28, Cam Ford. A four-year member of the program, Cam has been a crucial leader for his teammates well, since his arrival at UMB. In his four seasons, he has appeared in 28 games, earning his spot in the starting lineup 13 times. Today, he has found the back of the net four times and has three assists. He is currently one ground ball away from matching his career best and has helped anchor the Beacons defense and midfield all season. This season, Cam has led the Beacons to their first ever LEC regular season title and number one seed in the LEC tournament. Hailing from Worcester, number 28, Cam Ford. Charlie has provided a total of 34 saves and 12 games played. The leader on and off the field, Charlie has worked IOC to help the Beacons become one of the top Division III teams in the Northern region. Last season, he helped. He appeared in two games and registered a career-high 17 stops. This season, he has helped the Beacons secure crucial conference wins and has 10 stops on the today. Hailing from Bedford, number 33, Charlie Cook. We'd like to thank each of these seniors and their family members for their countless contributions to the university and wish them the best of luck in next week's LEC tournament. 